One common therapist mistake has to do with building the therapeutic alliance. You know, a lot of people have learned in graduate school someplace along the way, for example, not to use self-disclosure with clients. I find that one of the most important parts about CBT is being a nice human being in the room with the client and helping the client feel safe. And therefore, there are a variety of techniques that we might use, including self-disclosure, so that the client starts to trust us, so the client starts to think, okay, I can reveal whatever I need to reveal. We want to work on the therapeutic alliance to the degree that we need to, that the client can get to that point. We don't want clients to go through sessions thinking, what is my therapist thinking of me? Is she judging me? Um, is she going to say something to hurt me? So it's really important, particularly when we're talking with clients with personality disorders, to do what we need to do to make clients feel safe and so that they feel a connection with us. And I think that's one mistake that sometimes therapists make, is not building that strong enough connection with their clients.